Another one of those World Heritage Sites. Amun. The hidden gates were located in the area of enemy forces had difficulty observing. The entrances were small and hard to distinguish from its rest of the fortress. What a smart way of uh, building walls and fortresses, the way the intelligence should be uh, to disguise and uh, made for a purpose, right? Yeah. World Heritage Site, another one here in Korea, out of the Levin. Okay. Here's Namang's Han Sang Song. Is that right? Yeah. A World Heritage Site. I've been walking for five hours and uh, Fantastic, not a single foreigner apart from myself. Here, I'm in South Korea and no one I have met that is not Korean, apart from myself, huh? Yeah, there we go. That's what you call travel. This is the mountain of holy mountain for the Buddhist. It's a pilgrimage through several different trails up to the top and these fortified walls protected any enemies trespassing a dynasty or a power or a, a set of values. Of course over time it will be penetrated but yet it was held with known technology being used to be able to protect what was a common heritage to us all. And that said, we should pledge allegiance to our common heritage and the people of the world and methodologies. By doing so, I don't think we'll have to build large and tall barricades and walls and fortresses and moats and protection because if everyone is allowed to receive the same amount of good there will not be a need for extras this is a great wall of korea and a pilgrimage trail just like mount fuji fabulous place to be no tourists to this moment and I am fascinated by the history and the culture of this nation fantastic okay once again I'm at a fortress here in Korea it's sort of like the Great Wall of Korea yes folks Sharan is here not a single tourist they're all Koreans and that's the beauty of this place because I'm not overwhelmed by tourists and I've been cared for by the people of Korea because I very much want to say hello and uh, smile and laugh about everything we do in life of course folk let's go up here and see what we have the journey of discoveries yes several journeys of discoveries here yes. is that right absolutely indeed look at these little pagodas made by little marbles and pebbles and stones okay once again I'm at a fortress here in Korea it's sort of like the Great Wall of Korea Yes, folks, Sharan is here. Not a single tourist. They're all Koreans. And that's the beauty of this place because I'm not overwhelmed by tourists and I've been cared for by the people of Korea because I very much want to say hello and uh, smile and laugh about everything we do in life, of course. Folks, let's go up here and see what we have. The journey of discoveries. Yes, 
several journeys of discoveries here. Is that right? Absolutely. Indeed. Look at these little pagodas made by little marbles and pebbles and stones. Okay. Gentleman is doing the wall right, right. around. Right. Wonderful. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> smile, smile. Smile. Huh? Smile. <laughs> Fantastic, sir. Thank you. Hello, sir. Okay. Good. Wow. So. So. Here's the Korean Great Wall. Let's go on this trail. No messing about, for Keep your pace. Nobody about at the minute because it's getting cold. If it's cold, think about it's warm. Think about it's, it's so warm and so, so fascinating, the nature. The nature is where we get our life from. Our life depends on our nature. Our nature gives us all possibilities. Yeah, <laughs> great. So, whatever we do, however we behave, we should give a great respect for this beautiful nature that we've got here. Huh? Fabulous. Huh? Okay, here we are. Now, who like to say that they have seen Korea? And who like to say and describe what is Korea like? I haven't seen a single tourist on this trail since I left the airport terminal. I haven't seen many of the locals either who are willing to go up on this trail, up on this wall. Matter of fact, I am the last lunatic on earth, is it? Maybe not. I might be the one. Maybe not. Every one of you who are watching this video and making commentary about how easy it is to play your Candy Crush and how frustrated you become when you can't get to the next stage of your Candy Crush. Yet, that has made easy by understanding the human weakness, by creating what is called a pay and stage advance on Candy Crush. So, you can now move on to the next stage without having to try and experience your difficulties, even playing Candy Crush. There is no other way to go up this wall other than to keep moving your entire body plus the 20 kilo pack on my back together forward. It'd be very interesting. Hello, sir. Hi. Okay. Just doing the outside of the wall. Met a few guys and uh, training along with those guys to the south gate. No! Is it north gate? Or east gate? Or is it what gate is it? Never mind. Whatever it is, beautiful flowers here. We are here, Namsung, Korea. 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 Number one. Number one. Beautiful, sir. Thank you. Wonderful. There we go. The gentleman is still smiling and he's happy. Fantastic, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, I'm on the Great Wall of China. No, 
I'm on the Great Wall of Korea. Yes, folk. That's what I'm on at the moment. So what is really important is that no tourists. Sharan is here. Yeah. It's very few that would prefer to spend time out here getting dirty. No, not really. Getting connected to the nature and reality of our lives. And everyone else is in neon districts and shopping world of fake and temporary artificiality of life. Much said, they're confused by the amazing amount of array of light that is hitting on their face, on their eyes and their iris, and they're blinded by all that force of commercialism and a very powerful confusion that is lying ahead of them or surrounded them with or surrounded with so many of those confusions with advertising to methodologies and words of deceit and receive and deceive and receive method been applied to human innocence who said we can't build walls yes we can build walls but what's the reason for what's the purpose of building walls if you are pledging the allegiance to the methodologies and way of life and to the nature we only have to build the walls hello when we start being greedy, being ridiculous and silly. How much power do you want to hold on to? And how much wealth do you want to hold on to? If your wealth is only countable in terms of monetary means or in terms of properties or land, yet that wealth is irrelevant when you take that last breath and leave with that very last sigh. Yes, folk, there's no joke. This is no joke. I've got more than 20 kilos on my back. I want to do the hard way. I could have had a beautiful luxury car down below and brought me all the way up. Instead, let's go up. How people don't want to go up. And this is how the old did much of the work building this wall. It wasn't clear like this. There was no parts, there was no passage to the top. They had to work with hard and arduous conditions. Yes. I'm meeting a beautiful gentleman from Korea. Korea. And thank you for, and he's climbing all the way and he's taken my photo. Very kind person. And thank you, sir. Come yeah. with yeah. Take care. Ne? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Who said that the Chinese Great War was a hard one? Check this out. I've been walking on this trail of the wall for more than three hours, three and a half hours. Yes, this is the Great Wall of Korea, South Korea, sir. Come and explore it only if you join the natural world with Sharan climb out inside of the wall now how you see it from an enemy's point of view not an enemy's point of view in terms of what to talk and what to say enemy's view of this colossal fortress a great wall that protected here during medieval times